he like obliterates his yeah. competition. It's and ridiculous. And he's very calm while he does it. Oh yes. So Nothing we'll keep watching. Yeah. There's more stories to come on that. 524, it's never too early to start planning for retirement, never too late. But a lot of us have put it off for one reason or another. We find ourselves uh, a little or a lot behind from where we should be. So what can we do to catch back up? A lot of people think, oh, I'm in my 40s, I'm in my 50s, it's too late. It's not the case. You just have to really get on the ball here. Yeah. So I talked with Nancy Tangler. She's a financial advisor and expert. She recommends three to four million dollars to retire depends on what kind of lifestyle you have okay. but she says you got to start making some moves here she said if you're in your 30s and you haven't started saving you are not behind yet but she says you better get busy invest in your company's 401k or open an ira ira your 40s she says are your top earnings year so this is the time to put away a lot be aggressive here she said if you're in your 50s and 60s yeah, you need to be even more aggressive because your savings years are limited. So which stocks should you look at? Well, she recommends young people invest in companies that are industry leaders, ones they don't have to worry about being around, things like Facebook, Apple, Chevron, the tried and true. Other tips include opening that IRA and investing even small amounts every paycheck, 25, 50 bucks. She says be aggressive. Retirement, she says 20 years of unemployment, if you look at it that way. So work as long as you can, and then again, be aggressive. And she says, whatever you do, do not look at the stock market every day. Well, the market is always climbing a wall of worry. There's always problems. And so what I would advise people to do is not look every day. Um, you don't revalue your home every day. Stocks are meant to return over a three to five year period. Yeah, she said you'll just stress yourself yeah, out if you sense. you know watch the, the markets go up, especially yeah. recently with all the stuff with oh, China. Yeah. Yeah. So she says just be consistent and aggressive and just keep at it and you'll be keep okay. Keep your eye on the prize. That's right. Oh, good advice. Heidi, thank you.